Hey y'all, Sarah Lou Who here, and we are back again with Zero Time Dilemma. So last time we discovered that the mysterious missing room on the map was actually, apparently, Zero's study. So that's something interesting. We are in our Saw Killer's private room where he keeps all of these interesting things. We found a note that said, uh, like, had all the teams and stuff, and they had, like, asset. Let me see if I can. Should be in here, right? Uh, yeah, here we go. Bullet for C team, arrow for Q team, and acid for D team. And D team is marked out, and I'm pretty sure that's because we killed D team, or did we kill C team? I don't quite remember, but yeah, we got that, so. We're trying to figure out the remaining few puzzles in here. I believe we got this over here, and then we have, uh, there's a nurse safe over here somewhere. Yeah, we got this over here, and... Then I think all that's left is the weird portraits. Yeah, because I don't know what this is about. But yeah, last episode wasn't that great. I'm going to admit that, guys. Like, I was just having a really bad day, and I was in a rush, and I was trying to get through this episode, and I was just getting super annoyed. And I'm sure it came across in the video, and I'm really, really sorry about that. I'm going to try to be better about it from here on out. I'm going to try to devote more time to this and not make it as awkward as the thing is last time. I don't think it's for organizing papers, but it won't open. Yeah. Let's look here again. There's nothing left. That's right, we got stuff out of there, right? Alright, so then we just have these safe thingies to figure out. We have puzzles for these. I'm pretty sure this is the biggest safe in the room and it's locked. Why would it be? That's the question. Is this the keyhole? It's so big, we definitely know that the key, uh, they're, they're the key for this when we see it. Yeah, but didn't we, I think, wait, I think we have something for that, though. I thought we had a key. Are you a key? You look like you could be a key. It's a weird part with the letter B engraved on it. Yeah, so do all these things go together? Can I combine these somehow? Drag the item to combine it with them to the center, so that's B sub C. Hmm. Let's see. Maybe we can try combining these two. Ah, oh, there we go! We got part CD! Nice! Okay, so we still have no idea what it is. Yeah, but I think it's supposed to be like a crossbow, because we have the crossbow here. Matter it's a key. No, it has the pointy tip. It has to be the crossbow, right? So then we combine E and F. No, it could be a key if this is the front of it. Okay, then can we combine these two? Um, no? Really? Well, if we try it this way and backwards combine. No. Nope. What if we try to combine these? Nope. Alright. That's fine. We'll figure it out when it gets to it. Okay, so... I'm pretty sure that these might be for this. And we have this over here. Do we get anything? There's no keyhole, but the door is cracked. Maybe we have to force it open? That's a possibility. I think that's another part in there, along with what appears to be a note. Alright, um... Well, if that's all there is there, then... Maybe we can figure out this? It's a fee doll. The way you think these things are- I yeah. The way this thing's eyes are looking at me. It's pissing me off. What? What kind of- It's an adorable freaky alien thing. Why is that pissing you off, man? The note said, acid to D team, but there's a line through it. What does that mean? Is this a hint? We have Carlos's weird Ken doll. Pink shirt and blonde hair. Looks like Carlos. The note said, bullet to see- uh, to see team, I guess we shoot the pictures with the gun? Is that what we do? Let me see if I can remember on my controls. So I have some way. Yeah, yeah, there's my little troll face. I know there was some way to switch things up here. I just can't remember what. Oh well, I guess I'll have to do it manual. Okay, so do we shoot it? The note says bullet to see team. So how about we shoot them? <laughs> I know they're just pictures of dolls, but it feels kind of wrong. Oh my god, we can shoot it! Okay, so Carlos was on C-Team. Fuck, who else is on C-Team? Uh, 
the Japanese people, right? You and... Uh... You? Correct? We followed the note and put bullets to C team. I guess arrows are up next? Um, I suppose so. So that would be... I guess it already does have an arrow. I did not notice that before. Um, so that's for us, right? So the notes we found said arrow to Q team, right? Meaning we need to shoot our pictures with a crossbow. Hold on a sec. It still feels really weird, even if it's just pictures. Yeah, I don't know what's gonna have to happen. If it makes you feel better, I'll shoot you last. <laughs> there you go. You were the crying baby. Yeah, I think we did it! Shooting our pictures of us as dolls feels worse than I thought it would. We finished, so don't dwell on it. Come on, look. There's something behind it. Oh, sweet! It did work! Oh, something's here? What? What is it? It's a grenade launcher! Because that's what you expect to find here. What the fuck? Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I have an idea. Oh my god. Please tell me that this is what I think it is. Because they said we had to force this, right? Chick, chick, bam. Grenade launcher. This thing will blow that safe store to pieces. H hold on a second. We'll be in pieces too if you fire that thing here. He's right, we don't even know how much firepower it has. Then how about we shoot from the second floor? Come on, that's, that's gotta be far enough, right? Yeah! I cannot believe this. Well, I guess it's a little better to shoot it from here. Fire in the hole! <laughs> Wait, we haven't checked to see if it's really safe! Doesn't matter. <laughs> oh my god, I didn't think it'd be that powerful. Well, it worked. That's why I said to wait. We're just lucky we're all okay this time. Ah, uh, I think the door broke open. Everything is fine, so let's just go back downstairs. Whoa, it really is in pieces. Let's see what's inside and hope nothing's broken. Well, at least it worked. For once, Eric actually has something right. These figures are inside the safe and they're all in the same pose. It must be important somehow since they were locked in the safe. Hey, there's something else in here. We got party! Nice! It's a strange part. What could we use it for? The letter A is engraved on it. What does it mean? I think it means you're adorable. Eric, you... You fail, buddy. <laughs> so, these two? Yes! Awesome! Okay, and then do we combine all these? Yes! What are we creating? It's amazing, whatever it is. It is a key! So what's this thing? Maybe it's a key? Even if it is, it's way too big. Except for one thing! Oh, a new note. Okay, J053. What did these things mean again? Because I know that those have- like, we have those three in there, so that has to mean something. Um, okay, from right hand raised is the grass dance moves, three down. Left hand raised is the sand dance move, five down, and left hand extended out is the wind dance move, seven down. What do we have here then? Okay, so that's left hand extended out, so that's seven down, so that must be for that note that we found. Alright, let's look at that note again, because this has to go to the chair, right? So J, five, three, and then seven down for all of them. So come on, let's put it in. Let's try inputting again. Let's try it. Okay, so... Wait, this isn't the right thing, is it? I guess it must be, right? 05... 03, right? No? That's not right. That's strange. I put in J0503 in, right? Didn't I? Hey, didn't we find a note of the safe we blew up? Huh? You know what? There was something else in there. Yeah, but... So... Okay, so if we're moving seven down, one, two... Three, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, so Q... And then... Twelve? And then what was the last one? Three, so ten? Nope, wrong one. Oop. That should be right, correct? Oh, it worked! Let, uh, have a safe trip. Just kidding. That's right, because Q goes on his own. Make sure you get whatever's there. Well, let's see what it is. Whee! <laughs> what we got this time? What is it, Q? Whoa, that was scary. I almost fell out of the chair. 
I don't really see a need to have this device, though. Why not just move the books? I know Zero's super weird, right? So, what did you get? Oh, this! And it's a blueprint, and it just tells us everything we already did. <laughs> what great useful fun! <laughs> okay, so then we use this on this thingy. It's a big safe, the door is locked. Locked, the last key we have is... Yeah, we, we use the key. The key should fit right in. I hope we can find clues to who Zero is this time. Something awesome has to be inside a huge safe like this, right? Well, let's see. What could lie on the other side? Yay, it opened! Haha, uh -huh. kill one- WHAT?! <laughs> oh, come on! What is it now? You found it! A kill? Still rookie. Achievement unlocked. What does that mean?! I don't think this means anything good. Kill one. Uh, what does kill one mean? That's the question! It must mean we have to kill someone. Who, though? We have to- Again! Because remember, we're on the kill course here. What the? What is it? What are we looking at? Is that? No. Junpei. Oh, yeah, that's right. We did kill them, didn't we? <laughs> Sorry, guys. I know that's your buddy, but you look pretty messed up. Carlos, what are you doing? Oh. Okay, su suicide by axe. That's a new choice. No. <laughs> Did Carlos just kill himself with an axe, no less. I think so. But why? Maybe it had to do with Junpei's body. I can't remember. Is it C team or D team? The current casualties that we killed. C team. Carlos. Junpei. But Akani still alive. Wait, almost everyone's These dead? Are now deceased. As a result, five X passes will be revealed. Five Sweet. Jump. Blue. Red. Milk. Okay. That is all. So that means we just have one person left to murder. So I guess Wait, we killed all uh, of D team, right? It mentioned five people, right? Yep. Aside from us, Akane's left. So we have to hunt her down and kill her. During the vote at 1330, D-Team was- Executed. Well, the reason why isn't the issue. What's Have the- is the Dude, did anybody notice that? The portrait's changed. In other words... If one more person dies- We all go free. Let's get to murdering, guys! <laughs> oh, I'm excited. Even we all throw all weapons! Yay! <laughs> this is so bizarre. Oh my god, I love it. <laughs> We should stay calm now. And kill. Let's just put these weapons down. Put yours down first. Oh wait, are we at each other's throats? Well, what, what are you saying, Eric? If, if, if I put mine down, then you'll... Huh? You'll kill me. Over you have a fucking grenade launcher, man. You'll kill us all if you fire it. Why, Mira? We're in love. We're I think that's in your head, buddy. Um, Eric, this will be hard for you to hear, but I think you might be mistaken about that. You're lying! No. Then why is a gun pointed at you right now? I mean, it's not what it looks like, Eric. What's going I on love here? You with all that I am. Uh. Mira. So you know what you need to do, right? Huh? You. You don't get it? I. Uh, what? Um. What do you mean? Why can't we just go hunt down a Connie, what guys? <laughs> I'm trying to get him to kill himself. Pointed at him so that I can protect you, of course. If I drop my weapon, then Eric will. Then Eric, how about you putting yours down first? No way. Guys, come on. This is. If I put this down, you'll definitely kill me. I'm a baby. Come on. How would I know? What proof do I have that you won't up and fire that thing? Because we can all just go after Akani. Like, why can't we just go like hunt her down? I mean, I know this sounds kind of awful, but we've already killed enough people, so let's just keep killing. <laughs> hey, we aren't getting anywhere like this. No, we're kind of at a standstill if here. Just one more person dies. It doesn't have to be any of us three guys. One more person. One more. Just 
one more. All we need to do is kill her. We just need to find a way to get to her. Or mess with her mind. In the darkest way as possible. Time to decide. Do I really have to? Um. Can we, can we put in Akane? Like, that was her name, right? Can we kill her? Yes. Cannot get towards C. Oh, you clever bastards. Um. What about Zero? Can we kill Zero? <laughs> Don't, do not know identity. Okay. Um. Would the dog count? <laughs> I feel bad about this one, but he is not here. Fuck, okay. <laughs> You're a clever game, you know that? Oh, uh, son of a bitch. I, 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 I don't want to kill anybody. Come on. Who can we kill? Who can we kill? <laughs> Eric? I mean... Cause there's no one else here, son of a bitch. Bye, Eric! <laughs> Your choice is made. Nera, you know what we have to do. <laughs> yeah, it's his own fault for being such a douche. If there is anyone else here... Yeah, the portraits totally changed! Sorry. What? Are you for real? Yep. <laughs> oh, I got the plot. <laughs> oh, we're terrible. I'm sorry, Rick. Mira, are we cool? I mean, probably not, but still. <laughs> Eric. <laughs> this is a joke. Right? Uh, not really. Mm, Kinda fucked up. Like it got you pretty good. Jesus Christ, Mira, just shoot him! We moved to help you right now, but... M Mira? Eric, I'm going to kill you. Cause you're dead one way or another. I see. Of course. You only need... One more. Thank you for being so understanding. Any last words? Mira... Ah, uh, I feel really bad for this guy. Look better when you smile. Yeah. Well, well, then. Why? You shot him, Q. You don't get to whine about this. You're asking me that? You're the one who took the first. Yeah, shot. I'm with her here, man. We killed him. Yeah, you're right. But. How, how can you be so calm about it? Calm? Oh no, I'm actually surprised right now. What, seriously? I had no idea his last words would be the same as my first. Your oh, first... Oh, you're a Black Widow, huh? No, not that way, it's something else. <laughs> first of all, it's not as if I was actually dating him or anything. I guess you weren't really in love then. Even if he convinced I himself. he thought we were, though. I just let him go since it would have been a hassle. Dude, this is really fucking dark. What about how Eric feels? His feelings, huh? Well, they don't really matter I've now. I've really been able to understand emotions my whole life. Oh, she's a complete psychopath. Anger, sadness, pain, fear, and things like love. So when Eric said he liked me as much as he did, I didn't know why. I don't it's even probably because really of the tits, sweetheart. He he Just died. saying. Oh, come on. What are you? Why? Why? What the fuck, lady? I'm just gonna paint my body with blood. Just why? What are you doing? I'm going to touch Eric's heart. Why? Ever since I was little, I've always been told I'm callous and unfeeling. Why did the faces on people change? <laughs> what I never the fuck understood are we watching, watching right now? I'd take a mirror and practice making them every day, but they never quite looked right. One day my mother told me something. <laughs> Deep inside a person's chest is an object called a heart. This heart controls their emotions oh and changes their expressions. I remember thinking, that's unfair. Why was everyone hiding this important thing inside oh so no one else God. could see? I wanted to see what it looked like. I bet you did! Are you having fun? 
I decided my first would be a woman, about the same age as my mother. I waited on an isolated street so there would be no bystanders. How old were and you? I stabbed her without warning with a small knife I brought with me. I'd practiced on animals, but I was still surprised by how fast she collapsed. Why did you do this? Did you touch her heart too? What a heart is. I think I'm the only one who doesn't know. Oh, God. Hey, that's where you hide it, right? I know where it is. Jesus Christ, Mira! Hurry up and show me! I forgive you. What the hell? Oh, please don't ever do something so terrible again. Can you do that? This is the most understanding what? woman ever. <laughs> because smiles look better on you. What the fuck, Smile. lady? The woman didn't answer me. Why would this? I patted at her face for a long time. She didn't even blink anymore. Mm. When I gave up on waking her, I thoroughly searched for her heart. Good for you, I baby Mira. Time, <laughs> but I soon felt an unfamiliar, warm, comforting sensation. I knew it. It was here. So she found emotion. The last expression the woman formed on her face was a smile. In a heart. Well, that's when I realized that this kind of moment was when you should smile. When you die. I began to hunt for that, reaching out and touching heart after heart. I was terrible at it at first. I barely touched hearts and always badly. But after doing it over and over again, I eventually got better at it. Fear, hatred, sadness. Uh-huh. I learned about so many emotions by touching hearts. Now this is there actually kind of interesting to, to me because new studies are showing that apparently psychopaths that first, can kind of feel. They just have the ability to, to turn their emotions on and off. Part. I wanted to feel that warmth one more time. And so she's wandered able to discover emotions to when killing. Warmth. And that was how one day I came across Eric. And Eric was all like, I love you. He was working at an ice cream shop. Oh, go figure. With one and yet he voice. hates children. I could tell Probably he why. was useless. <laughs> no talent, no worth, nothing. I've seen many hearts of those like him, but none held my interest. Naive, helpless weaklings. It's as if they're amusing creatures simply there to be exploited. And yet- That's all I saw them as. But Eric, something felt different with him. I stopped by the shop several times to watch him. I just had to figure out how he was different from all the others. It's because he reminded you I of his, your first, him. right? <laughs> I spent time speaking with him, going places together to learn how he reacts. But I still didn't know. At one point, I thought I'd made a mistake. But... Then you wound up here. Still digging for that heart, I see. This, this is it. <laughs> this is I so knew fucked up. Eric would be different. I had a hunch when I first met him, and I was right. So what's up with his heart? I told you, didn't I? Yeah. And his last words were exactly the same as my first. Oh, you got that warm, comforting How feeling. How incredible is that? Prit oh, oh my god. <laughs> There's so this much of it. Really truly loved me. Oh, that's why he was different, because it was love at first sight. Oh, that's so horrible. So this is love. This Oh, she finally got to experience love. Now 
and we can all get the As fuck out of here. Six X passes will be revealed. Find, jump, hold, blue, red, milk. That is all. Thank you, weird announcement lady. So, crazy killer lady, shall shall we go? Or are you feeling in the mood for more killing? She's just covered in it. I just noticed. I think that's an anagram. Yeah. An anagram. Somebody else mentioned that. You switch the letters around to get a different meaning. The truth is invisible. So that's what it changes to, huh? What do you think it means? Hmm. I'm not really sure. Maybe it's similar to a human heart. I, I wouldn't see understand. It's hidden inside your chest. Please stay away from his chest. Oh, good. Puppy, you're here. Wonderful. Alright. Should I put them in? Yeah, go ahead. Well, um. Oh, poop. What were they? Uh. It was. Fight. It was one. Jump. Was another um, core blue, and then red and milk, right? And that should be all of them. Well, let let's go. <laughs> I guess we got another ending. <laughs> I have no idea what the admit grabs could be, but. At least three of us got out of here alive, even if, if, even if Eric wasn't one of them. I love that this dog is just like completely chill. Okay, let's go. Yeah. Whatever you say. Oh, the dog's with Mira. The dog likes the psychopath. Wonderful. Hurry, puppers! So, uh, the Connie, uh, how, how was uh, the murder on your end? <laughs> yeah, with our betrayal and all. Or are we just going to end it here? Just roll credits. Are we rolling credits? Yep, we're rolling credits again. Wow, we got another ending! <laughs> and we found out Mira's true face. Uh, was not expecting that. <laughs> oh my god, okay. So that was kind of batshit insane, wasn't it? <laughs> Uh, I love this game. I don't know what it is. It's just, it's so completely mind-boggling. Like, I'm not sure I would be even reacting to these properly, even if, you know, I had played the previous two games. I, I honestly think this is just flat-out insane, even if I did have any kind of context for the situation that they were in. I don't think that would affect my opinion about these guys. <laughs> so, yeah, okay. Um, let's see. I think we're going to try and go back and do something a little different because, like, I screwed up the first time, right? Like, I said that you we were going to, you know, go and try to get everyone to cooperate with each other and stuff, and I kind of, I, I screwed that up big time. Because, you know, I went with the D team, got them all murdered by accident. <laughs> I'm really curious as to what happened with C team, but first off, I want to try... I don't know, actually, now. Because I kind of want to go back and, you know, do everything proper, but I'm really having fun with just... All the killing. God damn it, the killing is not fun. I wonder what would happen if we killed Mira instead of Eric. He would have probably lost his absolute mind at us. Like, I don't know. We would have probably ended up dead, too. I kind of want to see what the other ones are, but at the same time, I also want to see what happens if we... You know try to all cooperate because I figure if we you know cooperate with each other then we'll get some semblance of a good ending and we'll all you know we'll get more answers trying to go that route because like this is going by sort of visual novel formula isn't it because it's like we, we're getting bad endings here like the first one and stuff where we picked the correct side and the flip of the coin, you know, that was technically a bad ending because we didn't get to experience anything. And then this was also a bad ending because barely anybody made it out alive and freaking Eric got heart ripped. It was so weird. 
and stuff. And so I'm thinking if we keep on with the murdering ways that we're just going to experience a bunch of different bad ends and they're, they're going to be, you know, really short like this one technically was. Because this wasn't too long with the playthrough, was it? Because if I had figured out how the puzzles worked last episode, you know, quicker, then we would have been through this in all in one episode. So if we keep on going by the bad ending format, we're just going to run through everything really quick. That or we can you know, try to actually do the proper good route. So, I don't know, what do you guys want to see? Do you want to see more bad endings, or do you want to actually try to get some real answers out of this, you know? Let me know, because I'm, I'm not too sure which one I want to do. I want to do both, and I'm probably going to end up doing both. That's just, you know, what do you guys want to see first kind of thing. Anywho, again, I apologize for last episode. I said that at the beginning, but I wanted to say it again. I'm really going to try to be a bit better about figuring things out and try not to approach these with a bad mood. Because you can't go into puzzle games, you know, annoyed or stressed, because you're just going to get more annoyed and stressed. It's like, you know, that's just how puzzles work. They're there to piss you off with their, <laughs> you know, puzzleness to help you figure it out and crap. But yeah, I don't know. I just want to do, I want to keep playing the game and I want to, you know, get better about it. I don't want to ever go through that annoyed state again while playing this. So, you know, I just wanted to apologize again because that's really been bugging me because, like, I was really hesitant to come back to this one because I felt so bad about the last episode and stuff because I just felt like, ugh, oh, that was a complete failure on my part. And I really just want you guys to know that I recognize it and I'm sorry about it. Okay, producer, Yasu, you were, you did stuff. Good job. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, but, yeah, I guess that's all I really have to say for now. Like, you know, which, tell me which one you guys want to do. If you want to keep going after the bad endings, or if you want to try pursuing the actual probable route of the game, and we'll, we'll see what happens. So, you know. Uh, until then, you know, like and subscribe if you want to. We got ending one. Very good. And until next... Uh, yeah, so just like and subscribe if you guys want to. And I'll see you in the next episode. And yada yada yada. Thank you for watching! <laughs>